Raiders may have escaped with one there, and there's Taylor first to it in the offensive zone. Near half wall, fed out in front shot. They score! Brock Kulicki, 1 0, 73s. 12th of the season, Kulicki continues his torrid pace. Eastwood headed off. Some line juggling going on prior to the faceoff here, so the 73s strike first here at home. And off the drive there from Jordan Graham. And he just missed. Graham with it again. The wrister. This time he puts it home. Jordan Graham ties the game for Nepean. It's even at one apiece. Well, Jordan Graham is first of the season. That going along with four helpers now. And with just over 10 minutes gone in the opening period, we're back where we started. Beaudry still with it, tries a centering pass. That one picked off by Tyler Melvin and the speedy forwards away with it. Dished off for Lefave. He scores! Zach Lefave puts it in behind Blackwood. It's 2-1 to Pian, and we've got a skirmish here to the left of the goal after the Raiders put it in. They will take a 2-1 lead here by all accounts with 8.25 to go in period number one. That will be Lefave's 17th of the season. Attempted back pass by Rivard is intercepted. Here comes Savignac with Krulicki. Krulicki shot. Rebound. Savignac scores. Short-handed goal for the Kempfell 73s. They tie it up at two. Well, a nifty little rush. That's all it takes for the Kempfell 73s to strike. Krulicki with the original shot. Pad save was made. Savignac buries it on the rebound. His ninth of the season. Now taken on by Eastwood. In behind the goal. Here comes Larkin, centering pass. Lammy parked out there. In front, they score! Grant Eastwood. There was no hope for Evan Martin, completely out of position, as it was centered in front for Eastwood. He slides it home. 73's lead, 3-2. to two. Comes back, cross. Bennett for Cater into the corner. And out. Cater advancing, takes the snapper, and he finds the feta upstairs. Raiders tie the game on a power play goal. And that thing was absolutely ripped upstairs. Adam Cater, ladies and gentlemen, his first goal. And that's actually his first point of the season. And it's been a long road for Adam Cater to find that first point. I believe this is about his 30th game played. So he finally finds himself on the score sheet. Now Brazier again to the line, cross ice, Howie to the backhand, he scores! Patience from Johnny Howie, puts it home in the celly afterwards. It's 4-3 to three for the home side. Johnny Howie, his seventh of the season, and it was a beauty out in front for the Nepean Raiders Triple A team. He's wearing number 29 in purple on your near side right now. Trying to get involved in the rush. This one turned over. Jeff Taylor with Brazier. They score. That's how quick it happens, ladies and gentlemen. The 73 strike again. It's 5-3. Hunter Brazier make it 15 on the season. And a big time insurance marker for the home side. Right back on the attack. Taylor near circle kicked away. Now Brazier. Rolls it back, Johnny Howie controlling, thinks tipped on, Lammy got a stick to it, puts it through the wickets, Skepfell strikes again at 6-3. to three. Chase Lammy, the man from Sudbury, gets it done. And let me just update you, that is Chase Lammy's 14th of the season. Anthony Rivard controlling things, works it back to the point for Bennett, eventually here for Hillier. Back to the Bennett. Bennett shoots that one wide of the mark. Rebound shot. They score. How did that thing find its way in? I do not know, but Tyler Melvin makes good on the power play and keeping the Raiders within check here. It's now 6-4, to four, and that was Melvin's 12th of the season. The Ottawa Junior Senators leading on the road in Smith Falls. In front, off the post, and back out for Hunter Brazier. He scores, and the 73s back out in front by three. It's 7-4. to four. Brazier, that's his second of the night, and his now 16th of the season. Hillier engaged by Lammy. Lammy into the middle. Here comes Savignac, trying to bust by a check. Just takes it with him. Savignac to the backhand, turned away by Evan Martin. Just got a smidge of the glove hand to it. That was Larkin picking it up. 
Back to the midpoint. Blast there from Howie over top of the bar. And Coleman Bennett couldn't fish it out. Back to Howie again. He takes a one-timer. And he scores his second of the evening. Captain Johnny Howie. It's 8-4 for the Kempville 73s.